Look, the market is tough. I think we all agree it's difficult to get investors um, of all profiles to uh, get invested into the local market. Today, uh, to make them invest, you need to uh, take bigger risks and offer higher returns. I think that uh, it will slowly develop positively over 2025-26 together with um, anticipated uh, interest rate changes. And I think that especially in Poland in 2025-26, it might be helped by um, also anticipated faster economic uh, growth of, of Poland, which we uh, already see taking off now in 2024 and which should be more pronounced in 2025 and 26. The bottom line is making money first, right? So we are looking for businesses which are um, giving us returns uh, which are appropriate for our investors like uh, 15 to 20 percent and how we identify uh, um, targets uh, different. One is, of course, where we see companies where we believe that the sum of the parts is higher than um, the current value, like in Echo, for instance, which we bought in 2015, uh, the share price was at six, six slot here at the time. And we thought that the value, inherent value of the company is 14. If you restructure the balance sheet uh, uh, and you, let's say, um, separate the low yielding, uh, let's say low, low risk uh, uh, yielding assets from the development assets. So this is how we made two and a half times money and over 40% IRR. Then of course, also we are looking for good companies with bad balance sheets. Um, you know, we, we bought one company which we floated recently where let's say the, the, the financial structure was uh, inefficient. But also what we are doing, we are looking uh, for opportunities where we can be first mover in the market. So we created the first student housing platform in 2014, uh, uh, Student Depot, which we then, uh, um, with Oakley at the time, then we brought Kajima into it, then we sold our stake, and then we are now re uh, restarting the student housing business with Signal. But the same also is with resi for rent We were first mover in the PRS sector. Uh, where we are, we are having our 4,000 units, uh, operating another 4,000 under construction, and we did also another platform live spot in this sector. So where we s saw that the fundamentals were good, let's say an under supply of apartments, uh, and when we saw also from different markets, we are also analyzing, of course, different markets, the US markets, uh, European markets uh, like Germany and France and so on, where we saw, okay, there is a lack of the product. So this is more or less... Um, the different, some examples of the different, uh, let's say, business strategies. Real estate is not terribly innovative industry taken all together. So here, our innovation is more transporting proven concepts somewhere else in the world to Central Eastern Europe. And Nabil mentioned in many of, uh, of those recently we have launched self-storage business, which is only the second self-storage business in, in the current market. But you have done many of those uh, before. But uh, in terms of uh, technological uh, angle, it was not enough for us. So then uh, why we moved uh, from real estate farther to infrastructure and energy business, which is uh, these days very innovative in fact, thanks to uh, this gigantic uh, energy transition from uh, fossil fuels to renewable energies. And then we went farther, even technologically to circular economy and even to uh, B2B outsourcing services in area of uh, IT. So I would say over the history, uh, most of our innovations were actually taking some proven concepts worldwide and implementing them here in, in, in geography. And and uh, then moving, uh, staying in real estate, but uh, 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 widening our horizons to things which have more technological content uh, than uh, buildings which are at the end buildings. Yeah. What we both like in uh, GRI clubs is that, of course, we can meet on the one hand side in Poland, uh, our peer group, that we can have an informal exchange, right? Um, what we also liked is to go to the, for instance, to the uh, GRI in Paris or in Germany, where we can meet also um, other investors uh, or other investors uh, being located in, in, 
in, in London coming then more frequently to Paris and to Germany than to Poland, where we can have also again this informal exchange and um, also see what how other markets are, are working. The preference that we have is more the GRI retreat where you can also have, let's say, a true fire chat uh, discussions and let's say, uh, discussions where you have more time because it's done over two, three days where people are generally speaking in a more relaxed atmosphere and more open-minded uh, to have a, let's say, really frank discussion and not, let's say, uh, and being yeah, more honest. Mm -hmm.